Hi there. So um, we are actually filming two videos today. Um, one is I am canning some potatoes back here. And while they're canning, I'm actually going to get our dinner in the crock pot. And uh, as, I, as I said in my previous video, um, we raise rabbits for meat. And I prefer to cook them in the crock pot because they just come out really tender. Most of my recipes are really simple. This is no exception. Um, we'll go ahead and go over to the crock pot and I'll show you what I'm going to put in there. Alright, so I have dumped my two rabbits in here. And as I said last, now I do like to find the back strap or saddle or whatever you want to call it pieces, the boneless ones and get those on the top where I know where they are because I give those to the little kids. Perfect, all right. So we've got all four of those. Right there on top. Now that we've got our rabbit in, we're gonna go put, go ahead and put everything else in. Um, so in my cup here, I have got my balsamic vinegar, and I do a half a cup of that. And then the rosemary, the three tablespoons of rosemary, I like to put in here. The very first thing I do is put it in there and mix it up because I like it to kind of rehydrate because it is dried. And then I also have some garlic in here, uh, probably about two diced cloves of garlic. Um, so we'll go ahead and pour that on. And then we are going to add a, um, a half a cup of honey. And I did warm this up in the microwave just to make it a little easier to get out of my bottle here. So I'm probably going to need my knife. Now, rabbit is a very low fat meat, and you can do this with chicken as well. It's really good with chicken, but we grow our own rabbits, and so we use our rabbits. So I do add oil or butter or some sort of fat when you are cooking with rabbit. Um, this recipe, I am going to put in butter. And as I said, I've got two rabbits in here, so I am going to be using a half a cup of butter. Um, you could also use a third a cup of olive oil, you could use avocado oil, whatever oil that you like to use. Coconut oil would be fine, just some sort of fat to keep that rabbit really moist. So go ahead and do that. Put our lid on. And then we're going to cook it on low for six to eight hours. It's about 11 o'clock now, so I'm just gonna let this go until dinner time, and that rabbit is gonna come out super, super tender and really delicious. And here we are all done. Sorry for the steam. <laughs> there we go. So rosemary, honey, garlic, and balsamic vinegar. Looks fantastic, and it smells really good. <laughs> If you've enjoyed this video, please like, subscribe, and share, and we will see you next time.